here, dude. No. Hey. Ow. 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 He's got a gun. Fiddling in 21. Start me a second. Get a shot fired. Shot fired. Somebody fucking tase him. You're right behind him. Put it down. Start me an ambulance. Hey, dude, you're just gonna go to jail tired. You might as well stop, my man. Hoping to get one out in front of him. He just wrecked right into the back of that truck. Oh, we have a collision! Hey everybody, welcome back for another episode of Devon Plays LSPDFR. And today we are headed out with the Harmony Police Department uh, in this awesome 2014 Charger by Maurice97. Uh, skins are made for me by a good friend of mine, uh, so there's no download link for those. If you want it, you can let me know on Discord, and uh, I'll send it over to you. But uh, anyway, yeah, we're going to head out in the county today, uh, see what's going on out here in Harmony, see what we can get into, and we'll just go ahead and get started. 10 Lincoln 21, plate check. All right, so it's an ingot, uh, Victor George William 8324. Uh, suspended Victor license on George that one. Victor George William 8324, a traffic felony. So we'll go ahead and light him up. Approach with caution. Ten like a 21, I'll be on a stop. Copy that, backup required. Negative. Copy that, proceed with caution. So it looks like this light bar does that thing where uh, when it gets dirty, it uh, doesn't work too well. So let's go ahead and... Uh, Get that cleaned up. There we go. Look, we have lights. All right, cool. This guy stopped like a freaking idiot, so let's move him on down the road a little bit. Move him on down there a little bit. It's probably gonna do dumb shit now. I'll have to move him again, but that's it. Whoa, what are you doing, dude? Can go. No wonder your license is suspended. You're a fucking idiot. One more time here. Just a little bit further down so we don't get hit by a car on the side of Route 68. That would suck. All right, there we go. We got him stopped now. All right, let's see what we got here. It is a ingot, Victor George William 8324, as we already knew. Uh, registration on a vehicle is valid and clear uh, as the insurance. Uh, registered owner is a uh, Mason Harker. Mason Harker has a suspended license, 35 years old, no gun permit. Uh, speeding, first or second offense, and expired insurance. Somehow he got his license expired for that, so that's, that's out fucking standing. Let's go ahead and make contact with him. There are three people in this fucking car. We're going to need another unit. Hey, man, how you doing today? I'm Officer Devin Creeps Cedar, or not Creeps Cedar, Harmony Township Police Department. Do you have your ID on you, proof of insurance, all that good stuff? We're getting alcohol and Show narcotic indicators from the car here. Uh, the driver and left ba or back left yeah, passenger look thanks. nervous. We do have Mason Harker here uh, with an ingot, and he has given us valid information. Okay, man. Uh, I, passengers, let me see your IDs as well, please. All right, so also in the car, we have Belinda Rose right, and uh, Andre you. Debris. Okay, cool. So uh, let's go ahead. All right, driver, you know why I pulled you over today, man? Let's see here. He says, uh, my taxes pay your salary, pig. Okay, that's cool, but that's not why I pulled you over. The uh, reason I pulled you over actually is because uh, you're driving with an expired license, man. You wear your license suspended? Yeah, I'm sorry. Please don't send me to jail. Okay, man. All right, well, we'll see what we can do about that, dude. But, uh... Uh, where, where, where are you guys coming from today, man? You just out cruising? Okay, so you're just out driving around with a suspended license, so it's not really doing anything for your case for me not to take you to jail, man. Where, you, where you, you trying to go somewhere? No, you're just out cruising. Okay, cool. All right. Who are all these people in the car with you, man? You know these people? You don't know them? You, you just picked these, this woman and this guy up? You ain't never met them before? Okay. All right, man. All right, cool. Man, you seem kind of nervous, man. What, what, what are you nervous for? You just smoke some bitch and dope? Oh, okay. Well, I guess I'd make you nervous if you were talking to a cop, man, which unfortunately for you, uh, you are. So, uh, uh, what, what narcotics have you used, man? You dropped some molly and you're feeling fantastic? Okay, I'm also getting some alcohol smell out of the car, man. You been drinking? You're sharp as an eagle, no alcohol in your blood. Yeah, okay, just eat, right? Why don't you step out of the car for me, man? Cool, I appreciate that. Let's step over here out of the way, man. Come on. 10 Lincoln 21, get me a second unit. Backup needed in Grande Sonora Desert. All right, so we got, he, he is intoxicated. We're showing slurred speech. It would be the result of, oh no, here comes Bobcat 4. Everybody look out. Anyway, um, we're getting what would obviously be uh, alcohol intoxicators. We got Blaine County Sheriff on scene with us here. That's cool. All right, cool. Coming to that awesome 2010 Charger we used a few episodes ago. So, all right, man, listen. I know you've been drinking. Why don't you tell me the truth about that? I appreciate you covering me, man. Welcome to the scene. 
Uh, you been drinking today, man? Yeah, you had a sip of wine. Okay, and how long ago did you have that sip of wine? I want my lawyer to answer any questions. Okay, dude. All right, cool. That is, uh, that is absolutely, this is a Los Santos unit just drove by to check on us too, man. They must be real worried about us small town cops out here. Uh, all right, man, that's totally fine. You don't have to answer any question if you don't want to. Uh, I'm required to offer you the opportunity to take a field sobriety test. Uh, no, you don't want to take a field sobriety test? Okay. State requires me to offer you this opportunity to take a breathalyzer test. If you refuse a breathalyzer test, your uh, license can't be suspended for a year or more. Do you want to take a breathalyzer? No, you've been sober for over a year. You just told me you drank, dude. So, you definitely haven't been sober for over a year. So, why don't you go ahead and turn around and put your hands around your back for me, dude. You're under arrest for operating a vehicle under the influence of alcohol. You do have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in the court of law. You have the right to an attorney. Arrest, you can't afford one to be pointed to by the state of San Andreas. We'll see if he understands his rights once it finishes the animation here. 10 Lincoln 21, show one in custody. Copy that. All right, cool. Uh, you got anything illegal on you, man? You might have a spoon on you. Well, what are you carrying a spoon around for, dude? What's that for? Uh, where's that at? There it is. I don't know. I found it. I was going to give it to the police. So you, so you, you decided to tell me about a spoon that you found on the side of the road you were going to give to the cops. Well, congratulations. Uh, I found you. You can go ahead and hand that over to me now. And I'm going to go ahead and patch it down. See what he's got on him here. You got to get the other two out of the car, too. Shit. A Ziploc baggie containing 250 suspected MDMA pills. Well, he wasn't lying about that, Molly. Uh, far left wing flyer and a Trevor Phillips industry business card. Okay, cool. Cool. All right. Come on, man. Have a seat in the back of my car for me. All right, man. Have a seat. Watch your head. Boom. All right. So hey. that's refusal. That's refusal to blow, too. So he'll be, uh, he'll be going for that one. Hang on here with him, man. Let me get these other people out of the car. All right, front passenger, step out of that right car for there. me. Ten like a twenty-one. I need a female out here. Assistance required. In you watch her for a second Laura for Desert. me. She also appears to be intoxicated, which isn't against the law since she wasn't driving. Oh, Sir, shit. step out of the car for me. That's great. Watch her for a minute. Let's step over here, man. Got three units out here on this stop now. People are driving by, like, what the fuck's going on over there? Another Blaine County unit on scene. This time in the Impala. Or is that a? Or is that a? Caprice. I don't know. I don't know cars. All right, man. Listen, dude. You seem kind of, you seem kind of nervous when we were talking earlier. I was just kind of wondering about that, man. What's going on with you? You smoke some weed? Okay, dude. I don't give a fuck if you smoke some weed, man. It's all good. I ain't real worried about that, okay? But uh, I do need to know, man. I found dope on him. I found dope on your buddy, man. So he's going to jail. Uh, actually, we can do the statement for that. So the, your buddy's going to jail, man. Well, that, well, shit, that sucks. Yeah, it sucks for him, man. And, uh, you could be joining him if you're not honest with me, man. What's, uh, you got anything illegal, illegal on you want to tell me about? You not answer any questions? Okay, well, that's totally fine, but I am going to go ahead and perform a pat down of you. So why don't you turn around, put your hands up in the air, face away from me. That's great. That cop's hauling ass. Damn, where's he going? All right, cool. So he's got a legitimate Los Santos Police Department badge, a baggie containing one kilogram of tan powder taped under the subject's arm. And a save a receipt. This is Andre Debris. Okay, Andre. Uh, question for you, my guy. Uh, the fuck's up with this badge, man? Where'd you get this? You used to work for a local department? Okay, you used to work for LSPD? Well, you gotta give him your badge back when you quit, dude. Are you currently a police officer? Sure. Well, that's not really an answer, man. So until I get confirmation on that, I'm going to assume that you aren't. Uh, you're not coming back. Uh, well, I haven't run his name yet, so we'll have to check and see. He actually could come back as a, uh, as a legitimate police officer. But, uh, despite the fact of whether you're a police officer or not, dude, what is this kilogram of powder I found taped under your arm, dude? What's going on with that? Uh, where is it? Where the hell? There it is. Guy I bought it from said it was cocaine. Okay, well, thanks for admitting that you purchased a, a kilogram of what you thought was narcotics. That's enough for me. Turn around, put your hand around your back for me. You're under arrest, ma'am, if you'd be so kind. He's running. Oh, shit. Gun, 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 gun. Stay down, dude. Stay down. Stay down. Ten like a 21. Shots fired. Backup needed. Ten like a 21. Start me an ambulance. Ten like a 21. Start me an ambulance. Not one to start me an ambulance. Let's go ahead and do it this way. Gonna 
first responder out here. Assistance required in Grande Sonora Desert. All right, somebody cover me. I'm gonna move up and get the gun. All right, and I've got the gun scare. Okay, I, I mean, pistol whipping him in the face didn't really do him any good, but somebody hey. shot him right in the fucking heart. Whoever shot him, that was a great fucking shot. Uh, let's see here. All right, we have the pistol. The ambulance is, uh, 10 like a 21. I've got medics on scene. Dispatch. Copy that. All right, cool. We're going to go ahead and get traffic stopped here because... Hey, apparently, instead of medics, I got guys in a Tahoe in turnout gear. That's uh, not what I was expecting, but uh, must have called. I must have called I'm for here. the wrong group. It's gonna be okay. Oh, okay, that's cool. He's uh, standing up now while they're doing CPR. I've never seen that before. If he's alive, we're gonna hit him with all the fucking charges. So I wish when this happened, like if there were any other unsecured peds at this time, the officers on scene would go ahead and start putting them in uh, in handcuffs. Nah, this guy's dead. I can't let it slow me down. All right, so this guy's dead. Uh, well, I mean, he was muling a shit ton of dope, so he probably figured he was fucked anyway, so. Uh, but I appreciate that. Yeah, I don't know what he's going to. Oh, okay, apparently she got hurt somehow. Whoa. One of his rounds must have hit her because he went over to treat her now. Did we take any hits? No, we didn't take any hits. We just busted him in the fucking face with our gun. So, for funsies, let's see what that, let's see what that powder was. Narcotics field test here. And pop the trunk on our charger here. Uh, well, let's see if the MDMA is MDMA. No, actually it's not. Is it LSD tablets? Nope. Is it PCP? That would be a little weird. No? Well, that basically just leaves fentanyl. Or we're not going to get a positive test, one of the two. Uh, it's a baggie of fentanyl pills. Okay, well, that could have killed that guy. But what about this powder? What's that going to be? Uh, he said he thought it was cocaine, so we'll test it for that first. Not cocaine. Okay, well, then it could be, uh, could, could be heroin. Let us see if it is or not. Yeah, it's heroin. Okay, so he had a, uh, a kilogram of heroin. That would, uh, that would send him to jail for, uh, for quite a while. Uh, let's go ahead and, uh, we, we had a gun from him. Let's see if it's stolen or anything, too. Just, again, for funsies. Uh, we're gonna get a check on the serial number on the pistol. That's uh, unknown register. Or unknown owner, because it's not registered. Alright. Could, could be his gun. Not that it matters. Alright, cool. Uh, let's go ahead and get the, uh... We better, we, we should probably get the coroner out here. That body's just kind of laying there. Uh, dispatch, can I get a coroner out? Dispatch, can I get the coroner out here? Uh, doesn't look like it's liking that very much. So we'll just do it the old-fashioned way. There you go. Assistance Let's go required. talk to the female In now. Grande Sonora Desert. Hey, sorry your friend did that. The scene went sideways quickly. We're gonna switch buddies uh so we have a female guarding her now so um uh, tell you what i'm gonna do i'm gonna go ahead and just put you in handcuffs uh you're not under arrest but i am just gonna you, detain you for the time being based on the fact that your buddy just tried to fucking shoot me and i don't really appreciate that all right so here's my question i got a couple of questions for you really and you of course don't have to answer them if you don't want to but who the fuck was your friend that tried to kill me there you want to evoke your right to counsel? I don't blame you, quite honestly. I really don't. Let's go ahead and just have her pat down here. Ma'am, if you'd be so kind to just... Okay, no, apparently the male's going to do it. Well, not my department, not my lawsuit, man. Knock yourself out. She has a pistol magazine containing seven 9x18mm rounds, a far right-wing flyer, a phone number for Amanda DeSanta, and, paper, and another pistol magazine containing something, but nothing illegal. Okay, uh, let's just go ahead and... Uh, Let's just go ahead and uh, put her in the back of one of these other cars here. You like checking your car for bullet holes, dude? Whatever. Have a seat. I got your back. Appreciate that. Fucking sick. Well, don't stand right in front of me. You won't get pushed, retard. Where's a fucking coroner at? Oh, Hello. there they are. They're here now. Ten like a twenty-one coroner's on scene dispatch. Copy that. All right. 
search the car. See if there's anything else worth killing me over. Hello. Still haven't run their names. Haven't got a chance to yet. Uh, seven magazines of 50 caliber ammunition, or 50 caliber Action Express ammunition, a Ruger SR 1911. So there's another gun in the car. A pocket digital camera. In the trunk, there's a pocket digital camera, a 12, ounce, a 12 fluid ounce sprunk bottle filled with urine. Fuck you guys. And a case of piss washer, which is, what's the difference between the urine and the piss washer? That's what I'm trying to figure out. Uh, all right, cool. Uh, lastly, I guess, nothing in life is certain except death and taxes, says the coroner, and uh, he's not wrong. So, let me go ahead and run some names here. Uh, all right, so. Oh, well, he's dead, so we can't run his name anymore, so that's annoying. She has a gun permit, um, but no gun, so whatever. Uh, she's vowed and clear. Uh, no big deal there. So, after all that, all we really have are charges on the driver for driving under suspension and the, uh, and the fentanyl pills. And then, um, we gotta cut her loose, actually. Because uh, we ain't got shit on her. What, nothing illegal in the car. So, let's we'll go ahead and cut her loose. Nobody closed the door when you put her in the back of the car? Wow, you guys are you guys are great cops, man. I see why you work for the county. Step out of the car, man. So, uh, lucky for you, you're going to get to walk away today. Uh, do I have anything for that? Nope, I don't. Uh, so yeah, um, your buddy tried to fucking kill me and your other friends are going to jail for, uh, driving under suspension. So, uh, she says, oh shit, no way. Oh shit, yes way. Maybe next time you, uh, maybe next time you'd be a little bit more, uh, discerning about who you get in the car with. But, uh, we're gonna go ahead and let you go. You can kick rocks out of here. Jesus if you don't mind God. letting her go. Shut up. If you don't mind letting her go. Like in 21, uh, can I get a tow truck out here? All right, get out. Well, Car here, Fort. I guess we'll get this road opened up and uh, get those firefighters out of here. And uh, yeah, she's walking on out of here, and we're gonna fuck. We're gonna get back on the road, I guess. Citizens reporting a disturbance. Domestic, domestic disturbance in Sandy Shores. Yeah, we'll we'll take that. 10 like in 21. I'll, I'll take that. Copy that. We're moving right now. All right, caller is hearing a man and woman screaming from the neighbor's yard. Weapons unknown. We're gonna go ahead and you fucking douchebag. We're gonna go ahead and respond code three to that. Still using the uh, Touchmaster Delta siren. Uh, we can go ahead and turn our radar off. We don't need that running while we're driving here. All right, people, get the fuck out of the way. Come on. Good pull over there, buddy. Good pull over. We're kind of a ways off. Usually, usually it's us responding into Harmony to help them because they don't have anybody on. It's not usually us as Harmony responding to uh, uh, to mutual aid. So uh, we got a bit of a drive ahead of us here. This isn't even Sandy Shore. This is getting into Los Santos County. Let's do some dash cam driving just, just for the hell of it. Oh, hey, nope, never mind. We're going to... Okay, we're going back into the, uh, I think it's going to be off of Cat Claw. All right, let's go ahead and use our priority to get to this big-ass intersection here. All right, here we go. The truck going to stop? Well, no, we made the turn anyway. Out of the way, doofus. All right, we're almost on scene here. There's no houses back here, so I'm not sure what yard the caller in's talking about, but I guess we'll... Wait, no, 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 I made the wrong turn. It's these trailers over here. Light bar broke again. Let's go ahead and clean that again. Okay, that's one thing I don't like about this car, but uh, still really like it. I need to just turn on the keep vehicle clean option. We'll be good. All right. Ten Lincoln 21. Show me on scene. Show me on scene. Copy that. I hear somebody yelling somewhere. They're, oh, there they are. They're kicking the shit out of them. Ten Lincoln 21. Give me another unit code three. Backup needed on a... Is that a gun? Smoke tree road. No, no gun. All right, taser out, taser out. Hey, dude, you better fucking stop right now. Stop, stop, stop. Run. We're heading over now. All right. No, 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 no. I don't fucking think so, dude. I don't fucking think so. You try to hit her again, it's going to be bad. Stop. Stop. Oh, God, Get your fucking hands up. Lay down. Lay down on the ground. Lay down on the ground right fucking now. 
Get your hands up. You're gonna ride the fucking lightning again, dude. Lay down. I'm not fucking playing with you. Don't move. Don't fucking move, dude. Alright, let's get him in custody here. I saw him kicking the shit out of her. Alright. Alright. Ma'am, what are you doing? Tin Lincoln, 21, uh. I got one in custody. Got you, wandering hands, you stop right there. Whoa, hey. Ma'am, no, you're gonna stay here. You're not leaving. God damn it. Attention all units. We have a hold up at well, dispatch, you're gonna have to uh, you're gonna have to get somebody else to take that Response robbery in progress because we're kinda stuck on this. Ten Lincoln twenty one. I got one in custody. Copy Thank that. you. Alright ma'am, why don't you hang out right here? Uh can I ask my buddy to yeah. Let me ask uh my Sandy Shore. Oh now they got a Sandy Shores unit available. Of course they do. At least I got another unit out here though. I don't even know where the hell he's parked at. He just kind of appeared here. I don't even see his car. Alright, dude. Yeah, I'll walk into you. I don't care. Big man with your fucking fists, huh? Alright. What was that all about, man? What are you guys fighting for? Oh, why were you hitting her, man? Uh, where is it? What are you hitting her for, man? They slept with your dog? They slept with your dog? What? Alright, dude. Whatever you say. Who's she to you, man? What's your what's the nature of your relationship? That's your wife? Okay, so you're beating the shit out of your wife. Yeah. Okay. And, and, and why were you guys fighting again? You think they're cheating on you because of some texts? They think I'm cheating on them because of some texts they saw. Okay, so she thinks you're cheating on her and also something about her having sex with your dog, which, um, creepy. All right, cool. Uh, well, I saw you beating the shit out of her, so I really don't care, man. You're under arrest for domestic violence. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If you can't afford one, to be appointed to by the state of San Andreas. Do you understand your rights? Yes, but you want to tell your side of the story? You already told me everything I needed to know when I was walking up here and I watched you kick the shit out of her. So you can tell it to the fucking judge, man. Well, let's go over here to my car. I'd have taken that robbery if we hadn't been stuck on this, but can't just can't just run away for the fun calls, you know. All right, man. What do you got on you? Anything illegal? Oh, you might have some needles on you, you but you're diabetic. Oh, okay, cool. You got any guns on you? Any weapons or anything like that? You might have some needles. Okay, all right. Well, I, I appreciate you telling me that twice, man. I'll pass you down. I'll move. Don't do anything dumb, okay? Let's see what he's got on him here. He's got an unloaded Colt 9, 9, 9x19 Commander, an Ego Chaser Energy Bar wrapper, a card with lawyer Molly Schultz's contact info on him, an Ego Chaser Energy Bar, a Meltdown transcript, a premium deluxe motorsports business card, and a small flashlight. Yeah, lucky for him that he has Molly Schultz's contact info, because he's probably going to fucking need it. This is Ivan Diego. Uh, he's got an unloaded gun on him, too. I'm honestly not sure if that aggravates the circumstances or not. Oh, Jesus, that fire truck just appeared right there. Oh, okay. Have a seat in the car, sir. He does have a concealed carry permit. I wouldn't have charged him for having a gun on him on his... Actually, I do have one other question for him. Come to think of it. Uh, I'm not close enough to question him. Hey, man. Is this your legal residence? Do you live here? Do you live here or do you stay here? What's, a, what's it going to be, man? Yes, okay, you live here. Okay, all right. Cool, hang out. I'll fucking move. I uh, should have got her ID before we walked over here. Oh, well, I'll just have dispatch run her name. That's what they're for, right? Let's walk over here and see what's going on. Wearing the basket weave duty belt from Code 4 Mods. Uh, you guys should definitely check out their website. They got some awesome assets for EUP. It's pretty great. Thanks for hanging on to her for me. I appreciate it, man. All right, ma'am. So I saw him kick the shit out of you. So it's not a question of whether you want to press charges or not, because we're going to um, for domestic violence. But uh, I do have a couple questions in regards to what was going on here. What are you guys fighting about? Get this. They're mad because I think Bruce Spade is hot, don't you? Uh, I can't say for sure I know who that is, but uh, I'll take your word for it. And that's definitely not going to be any excuse for him to kick the shit out of you. Um, let's see here. Do you, do you want him? He says he lives here. Do you want to trespass off the property? Okay. All right. Well, we'll go ahead and issue a trespass warning for him. Then he won't be able to come back here. He'll be able to come back here and get his stuff with a police officer, but not um, not by himself. If he comes back here by himself, don't let him in. Just call the police. Do you understand? No, you know your rights? Okay, well, that's really not what I was kind of getting at, but, uh, okay. You do you, but you let him back in. The trespass is still enforceable. Uh, can I see your ID, please? Show me some ID. Thank you very much. I appreciate right. that. Thank you. All right, this is Amber. 
Amber ba uh, Amber Backman. Ten Lincoln Twenty One. Can I get a name check? Ten Lincoln Twenty One. Can I get a name check? All right. So yeah, a Amber Backman. Eleven Five Eighty Nine. See what we got. She's valid and clear. She's got nothing on her. Okay, cool. All right, great. So that's okay. Well, that's gonna pretty much do it for her. Um, she doesn't have any warrants or anything. I have no reason to pat her down or anything like that. She's not exhibiting any signs of uh, intoxication or alcohol. Um, she was definitely the victim here, so we won't be uh, hassling her with any of that. But uh, we will be uh, charging him with uh, all the stuff that we're gonna charge him with, and then uh, I think we're gonna squeeze in one more. So uh, yeah, we'll be back. Any unit in the Sandy Shore area, we have a robbery with a firearm. Well, there's on, that robbery um, we were talking about. Panorama Drive. And you turn around and get out there, Sandy Shores again. Oh, second time we've had to go help Sandy Shores, but I mean, we're always down here helping Harmony, so I guess it's not really that strange. That we'd, uh, yeah, I checked it to the Yellow Jack. All right. I guess that's really our problem and Sandy Shores' problem and Blaine County's problem, really. But yeah, it's at the Yellow Jack, so there went the uh, the light bar again. Let's get turned here. I'm going to clean the vehicle again because I like my light bar. It's in like a 21. I'm on scene. Copy that. That car looks like it's uh, useful for a getaway. Let's go ahead and get our handgun out here. Not our... There we go. What do we got here? We got anything here? What's that guy? Is there a guy inside there? No. I just heard shots. I just heard shots. Shots fired. Let's get some more units out here. There he is right there. Stop, dude. Stop, 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 stop. You better give it up, man. Give it up, dude. Give it up. Give it up, dude. Down your knees. Put your hands in your head. Put your hands in your head. Don't fucking move. Don't fucking move. There you go. I'd have shot him if he had if he'd come out with anything other than a less lethal fucking shotgun. Where'd you even get that, man? Ten like a twenty-one. I got him in custody. Copy that. Second ninety-nine of the day. Appreciate you guys coming out though. You see the Missouri cars. Lights aren't looking as good as they uh, as they were before. I have the most trouble trying to keep my lights looking good here. That's all right, though. All right, man. Well, let's get him over here. Put him right here. Will you watch him for a second for me? I appreciate that. Thanks. Let me grab the shotgun there. I thought I. There we go. Got it. Uh, saw. Uh, okay, so it's a, it's supposed to be a sawed-off shotgun, but we're gonna treat it like it's a less lethal, just because that's what the model is. I forgot that I'd replaced the sawed-off with it, so. All right, cool. Greetings. Well, you know what? Before we do that, hey guys, thanks for coming. I appreciate it. Let's go ahead and uh, you know what? Stupid ass me. You guys watch him for a minute. I'm gonna clear the inside of the building. Wow, I'm an idiot. Piece of trash. Uh, I didn't want to do that. Don't please. Just, don't. just hang out. Just hang out. Just hang out. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. All right. Bartender down or anything? Everybody inside seems to be fine. Anybody down? Yeah, we got some, we we do have one down. Ten like a twenty-one. Start me an ambulance. Ambulance assistance required. Let's holster up. See what we got here. Grand Maybe Bay I can see if I can no kidding. see if I can tend to the injured ped. Ambulance is on the way, but bartender's down. Stupid ass me to even think about that. You heard a shot. You should have known to go inside and check, but you know. It's less lethal. We might have got her in the head, though. I do see some blood on the ground here. All right. My attempts at CPR failed. We're going to get up and get out of the way. Uh, I do want to... Whoops. I do... Whoa. Okay. I do want to search. I just want to search real quick here just to see. We're going to spawn the medic. see here. Uh, Holland Styles received a Crocker Hooper seat and a naked photograph of the subject. This is Claudia Montero. Alright, Claudia, that's that's cool and all. Excuse me, officer. Appreciate that. Let's get outside. Okay, sounds like the medics are here. They coming? Yeah, here they come. I think I hear them running. Yeah, here they come. She's trying to get in there to her. Having a hell of a time getting a medic out here, you know. 
There they go. She's trying to get in there. All right, she got past the officer. There's the other one. She's trying to get back there too. However, she got confused and ran back outside, but whatever. Her being behind the bar kind of makes this a little difficult, but she should just teleport to position eventually. Uh, it's trying. There we go. There we go. That's not bad. They're even in pretty decent positions, actually. Of course, her head is going to disappear down through the bar here in a second, but whatever. Pretend like we don't see that. Actually, looks pretty good. Let's get that in first person. That looks pretty good there. Yeah, they're doing their best. Let's see if they have any luck where we didn't. They did not. It's murder then. All right. It's probably aggravated. Uh, it's probably involuntary manslaughter, to be perfectly honest. Or a voluntary manslaughter. I opt to look and see which one it is. I can't. Those lights were a lot redder when we did the video, don't you guys think? So why is he back out of the car? I thought I. All right, man. So, dude, why'd you do that, man? You know she's dead, right? Why'd you do that for, man? They pissed you off? All right. All right. So we got aggravated assault and uh, and murder. Of course, I mean, one kind of cancels the other. So what's the fucking point? But all right, dude. All right, man. Let's pat him. Let's pat him down. We haven't patted him down yet, right? I don't think so. Let's see here. I imagine that's probably his car right there. We'll ask him and see what he says. 32 ACP, Walther PPK, an insulin pen, several used syringes, a picture of the fleece, a bank branch taken from a distance. All right, so he's got a, it says Herbert Intro. He's got a pistol on him too, man. Uh, does not have a gun permit, so we'll get him for that too. Uh, where'd you get this gun from, man? Oink, oink, pig, I ain't saying shit. All right, man, well, you do have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to an attorney. Can't afford one to be pointed to by the state of San Andreas. Let's go ahead and put him in the back of the vehicle here. Have a seat, Mr. Intro. Uh, one question I did want to ask him, though. You don't have to answer if you don't want to, man, but, uh... Don't worry, uh, buddy! Why not close enough? Yeah, there we go. What, uh, is this your vehicle here, my man? Uh, there it is, yeah. Yeah, I say anything else? Alright, fine. Well, that's fine. I'll just go around the plate. You don't want to talk? That's fine, homie. Boom. All right, let's grab the plate and search the car. Well, let's grab the plate. I mean, I think he was moving towards it. That's probably not enough to actually justify searching it, though. Now, if it is his, though, let's have dispatch run it. 10 Lincoln 21. Can I get a plate check? It's a cheetah. Lincoln James Ocean 1452. Target vehicle license plate. Comes back to Lincoln a Marcus John Brooks. Ocean 1452. Right. A traffic violation. Now, yeah, let's Approach uh, with caution. Hey, let's, uh, okay, that guy just stole that truck right there. Alright, they've got her. They've got her. You guys can handle that. That's there. Okay, that's their scene now, not mine. So, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and have this thing towed. It's illegally parked. 10 Lincoln 21. Can I get a tow truck? There we go. Flatbed. Assistance required on the flatbed out um, here for that thing. Panorama Drive. Good uh good job on those guys though. You're just gonna leave her over there, huh? So I guess you want me to go deal with that right. too, huh? I already got fucking Mr. Intro on my car here. I don't need covering fire dude, we're good. Anyway, they tried to drive off too. Let's move out of the way for the tow truck here. I guess we'll deal with this one too though. What you trying to steal that truck for, dumbass? I wasn't very fucking smart, I wasn't. Oh, you're drunk. Okay. I'll cover you. Well, let's ask him about that. What'd you do that for? What'd you try to steal this fucking truck for, huh? Oops. Why'd you, why'd you turn off your body cam, cop? Well, I, uh, I didn't. Uh, it's definitely recording. Uh, let's see what she says about that. Uh, you and every other officer, hey, you better be recording. Well, we definitely are, so. Uh, all right, if you don't want to tell me why you stole the truck, that's fine. Uh, you're under arrest. You probably already figured that out for yourself. I'm gonna go ahead and patch you down here. Get her name, too. We're running both. It's kind of got a freebie here for this one. Why would you try to steal a car with a bunch of cops sitting in the parking lot? This is Alexis Dusk. She has a prescribed asthma inhaler, a parking ticket, and a ballpoint pen. Okay, cool. Hang out with her, guys. Go ahead and charge her, too, I guess. See whose car it is. <laughs> Watch it be her car. 10 Lincoln 21. Can I get another plate check? This is a bison 
Richard King X Ray sixty two forty three. Target vehicle license plate. Robert King. No registration, no insurance. An unknown owner. A traffic violation. Right. Approach with caution. Can't confirm it's her car. She goes for car theft. That's not her name. Only at that bitch towed too. That thing ain't legal. Alright, so who are we? Okay, so we got that's the bartender. This is her. She's got a warrant. Uh trafficking cocaine. <laughs> Five hundred to nine hundred and ninety nine grams. That four shouldn't be there, ignore that. Uh that's a fe that's a federal warrant for trafficking in cocaine. Well, and she's only twenty one years old. She's making something out of herself, man. Look at that. And then uh Hubert there. Uh he's got a suspended license, but that doesn't really fucking matter for us. Uh alright, cool. So Fuck, yeah. Lots of shit to process for this scene. That's going to definitely do it for this episode. But uh, we'll go ahead and get all these people charged, and then we will, uh, we'll be back for the court thing. All right, so that's going to be the end of the episode. But we do have the court stuff to do, so let's go ahead and get that pulled up here. I think we have four to do. Yeah. So we started with uh, Mason Harker. Mason was our, uh, our driver from that clusterfuck of a traffic stop we had out there on 68. All this over a uh, suspended license stop, which... I mean, people can fight sometimes when they want to go, you know, when they don't want to go to jail for driving a suspended license, but he wasn't the one who fought us. It was the passenger who uh, tried to shoot us over that um, kilogram of uh, what turned out to be uh, heroin he was carrying around. Uh, he said he thought it was cocaine, but it was actually heroin. Uh, he ended up, unfortunately, he passed away from, you know, getting shot and smashed in the face with a pistol. So uh, we didn't get to charge him, but we did get to charge the driver of the vehicle, uh, charged him with driving under, uh, uh, under suspension, uh, OVI first offense, and also possession of uh, fentanyl. Uh, I just went ahead and shot middle of the road on that one because I actually don't have a uh, a measurement for pills. I only have it for uh, for weight. So I have no idea how much a bag of 150 pills would weigh. Uh, we actually should have also charged him with a uh, refusal to take breathalyzer tests. So that should be another one year suspension on his uh, on his license. But uh, he's going to be he's already got a year. Uh, so actually that's going to be a two year suspension, two year and three months suspension for him. And he's going to do a year for the uh, for the fentanyl. So a year and two months for him plus a uh, two year and three month license suspension. So uh, what a twenty six month license suspension that ain't bad. Cool. Ivan Diego was our uh, domestic violence uh, up there in uh, Sandy Shores, charged him with domestic violence. Also having a gun in possession during the crime. I don't know if uh, I don't know if that's going to be legit. I don't know if the prosecutor's going to take that. They took it. So that's a gun spec. Uh, I mean, it, it, it's it's honestly it's honestly. Um, Probably safe to assume that he tried to, uh, he probably brandished it at her. I forgot to ask her. That's one thing we should have done was use the question. We need to ask her if he threatened her with, any, you know, with a weapon in any way. If you, if I had and she said no, I probably would have, uh, excuse me, I probably would have, um, probably wouldn't have charged him with that. But anyway, apparently he did and uh, they bought it. So he gets a year and five months on a misdemeanor one domestic violence charge. Not bad, not bad. So he shouldn't be back bothering her anytime soon. Uh, and then we had uh, Hubert Nitro. That was our shooter at, uh, at um, the Yellow Jack, I went with murder on it because he said that he shot her because she pissed him off. So that doesn't tell me that implies to me that he wasn't trying to rob the place or anything. It was a crime of passion. Uh, so that's where the aggravated assault and also the murder comes from. Granted, the firearm. Now the reason I did that was because he had that uh, he had that less lethal shotgun. I don't know whether it being less lethal would have actually mitigated the charge or not, but I I, I really don't think it would have. Um, but those are usually, you know, restricted to police. Uh, it looked like it was one of the Los Angeles police, uh, police department shotguns. So I'm going to assume that he stole it. We have no proof of that, but I'm going to assume it. Um, I think it's fair. Uh, can't get a weapon for the wall three on him and also discharging a gun at a crime. Uh, he's going to do uh, life. He's got life, but let's go ahead and add up what he's got. Here. He's got three years, six years, nine years, 10 years and three months. Oh, I'm sorry, 10 years and one month. So he's doing 10 to life. That's not bad. 10 to life is about right for that. 15 to life would probably be more correct, but that's cool. He's gone. 25 years old, and he's gone. I mean, he, first parole hearing will be in 10 years, so 2030. Um, and he probably won't get out his first time. So all over, a bartender pissed him off. And then Alexis Dusk, the most unopportunistic criminal I've ever seen in my life, uh, who tried to steal a car while there were like four cops sitting in a parking lot. I'm char charging her with uh, criminal damaging. Uh, that was actually from driving the car out of the pole, and it's a felony because she could have hurt one of those officers while she was doing it. Uh, it didn't really qualify for the failure to comply, however, so we didn't go with that. Uh, she didn't really run. Uh, Grand Theft Motor Vehicle for obvious reasons. And then also, uh, trafficking in cocaine. Uh, it probably actually is supposed to be 5000 since it's a federal one now that I think about it. But uh, anyway, uh, she had a warrant for that. Um, she's looking at 20, 22 years or one month. She's found not guilty of the criminal damage. Apparently the judge did not agree with my, uh, with my articulation of the events, but that's okay. It happens sometimes. Uh, 13 months for the Grand Theft Motor Vehicle and 21 years 
for uh, for the cocaine. So she is, what, 21 now? So she will be, what, 41, 42, 43? Yeah, 43 when she gets out. So yeah, most of her adult life, young adult life, is going to be spent in prison. Hope everybody enjoyed this episode of Devin Plays LSPDFR with the Harmony Police Department. I'm going to work on trying to get the lights fixed up again. I, I probably just forgot to reinstall my proper NVE file or something, or it could be the time of day. It could be any number of things, but uh, anyway... I think the game's still looking great. Hope you guys agree. You can let me know down in the comments below if you like. But uh, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. And as always, you stay safe out there, okay?